you guys happy friday my god it's been a long week it's been a long week right this can be a hard time of year for a lot of people it's dark when you get up it's dark all day it's rainy it's snowy it's cold it's dark when you get home and people that need the sunshine this this isn't it this isn't it right we live on the east coast and i say like god knew i needed the ocean he just dropped me off at the wrong side <laughs> today was a good day was a good day one of my little champions right my little daycare ones that i pick up always bends down beside the bus and she looks under the bus she's always looking under the bus so today i went over i said honey and I'm looking under too, right? I'm like, what are you looking for underneath the bus? She said, making sure there's nothing blocking it, like nothing stuck underneath. I said, all right, my girl, right? Thank you, thank you. I said, you know, I, I check it all out. It's all good. She goes, but why do you drive so slow? <laughs> right the snack table it got stuff blocking it right underneath so it can't move so she thought there must be something stuck under my bus <laughs> my other group were listening to christmas music right because that's what they requested and one little girl she can have a full conversation with me and the other eight people having a conversation with me and dance and sing at the same time to the music. Today, I told her, I said, listen, and I was pointing the mirror right before we leave. I'm pointing at her. I said, you are going to be famous. You're going to be on TV someday. You say, Diane was my bus driver. She goes, I will, I will. She goes, but you're already famous. I said, what do you mean, right? I said, what makes you think I'm famous? She goes, because you're a rock star. I call them rock stars, right? And I go, you're a rock star, you're a rock star. She goes, you're a rock star. I'm like, you just made my day, right? It's the little things like that that you gotta find during your day. Okay, you guys, so I believe people should meet each other through other people setting people up, right? So, you know, I picked up this client and this, this worker and whatever, and we're talking, she really lovely, right? She's really, really lovely. One of the guys I work with, he's single lovely guy right and she's just moved here doesn't know anyone so i call my co-worker i'm like hey i said listen this one i said she's pretty cute like you dropped her off before you think she's pretty cute and he's like yeah i'm like you should ask her out right i'm obviously the worst one to you know give advice but she don't know nobody she is cute and single so <laughs> he's like yeah are you shy what are you shy right what's going on right i'm off and then he goes I really can't talk about it right now. <laughs> I go, oh, you got someone in the van? What, do you got someone in the van? <laughs> he goes, yeah. I go, okay, call me back. <laughs> We're set up ever. <laughs> Try to help people find love. How about that? How about that? Just not when they're, they're still with the client in the vehicle. <laughs> I love you guys.